Starfish are interesting creatures and children especially like finding them on the beach or in rock pools. They seem to stay very still and don't appear to get up to any antics. It's estimated that there are more than 40 different varieties here in the waters around Iceland. And how on earth did this one manage to climb on this seaweed leaf? Or this one on a seaweed swing? Usually starfish have five arms, but they can have many more, as in this common sun star. A starfish unlucky enough to lose an arm or a leg can keep plodding on until a new one grows. This variety is called purple sun star and usually has nine arms or legs. Starfish catch shellfish and eat the contents. An ocean quahog has got dug in in the seabed. Here it sits filtering its food from the water. Shellfish are the main diet of starfish and they are particularly keen on sandwiches, bivalves. They attach their sucker feet to each half of the shell and tug it bit by bit until it gives way and opens up. It's a tug of war, but eventually the shellfish gets tired, runs short of oxygen and gives up the fight. The starfish then flips its stomach into the sandwich and starts to digest the fish from the outside. Starfish have two stomachs, one to digest the food and the other to shoot out and engulf and paralyze their prey. Here we see the common starfish or common sea star Asterius rubens, the most common starfish in Iceland, busy gobbling up a quahog. Here its belly is bigger than its mouth, but by extending its stomach and dissolving the prey, it can suck it into its mouth. If we disturb a starfish's dinner by picking one up and stealing it from under his nose, we can see how the stomach is distended. The starfish is a marvelous digestive machine, as not only has he two stomachs, but also digestive glands in his sucker feet. It's amazing the distance they can cross without hardly seeming to move at all. Like other echinoderms, starfish have a hydraulic system, which they use to move around. They suck in water through a madriparite, a porous, often conspicuous, sieve-like ossicle on the aboral surface. It's linked through a stone canal to a ring canal around the mouth opening. A set of radial canals leads off this. One radial canal runs along the groove in each arm. Muscular bulbs spurt the water out. The suction legs can also grip tightly and can either open shells or cling to steep rock walls. Starfish are the strong men of the invertebrate kingdom as well as being some of the giants.